Alrighty, welcome in everybody to another Mario Kart Tour new tour reveal. So, we have the Princess Tour coming in. And for the new tracks for this tour are going to include Wii Daisy Circuit and GBA Peach Circuit. So, uh, we're going to play through the tour for the first time, uh, check out all the new variants of each of these new tracks, and this tour is finished, so let's go ahead and load up the next one. So, welcome in everybody for another to live tour reaction. So, farewell me tour, here comes the princess tour. Oh, I don't know why my snowball is actually starting to peak already, so if anyone here in chat uh, wants to let me know how the audio balance is, please let me know, because I've updated OBS, but it seems like the mic microphone might be a bit more sensitive with this update. I don't know. Surprise is not going to the wedding tour of the day of mine. Yep, very surprised as well. Actually, give me one second. Is my new stream chat bot working? Give me one second. Let me check out something else. This chat loaded on the set. That is not even loaded on restream. What's going on here? All right. Download and update data. Come on, chat RLA, open up. He's not even loading on there. I don't know what's going on with Restream. Hang on, let me see if I can get that just so I can see it. Oh, I'm just still waiting for you five. Yeah, I can't, also can't wait to hear the Mark Tour version of Peach Circuit, so we'll have to see what's in store for it. So, uh, let me also try finding the YouTube stream, because it's... So I don't know if anyone's chatted on YouTube just yet. I imagine someone has by now, but I just, for some reason, I don't think the restream chat bot is here in the Twitch chat, so let me just go ahead and look over at the YouTube chat instead. Sorry if you, anyone in YouTube chat, but I haven't seen y'all yet. Seems like we are having some weird technical issues. So if you guys haven't already, make sure to leave a like on the stream. Yep, alright, there it is. So, what's going on with... Okay, neither... Okay, the bots just aren't here today, so I'm going to do my best to look at both chats. Alright, give me one second so I can set up the, the chat window so I can see both YouTube and Twitch chats properly. When I started up uh, OBS earlier, for some reason it just wasn't connecting to my Twitch, my Restream account, so we're going to just do some stuff manually, then we'll go ahead and start her up. Oh yeah, welcome in everybody to the stream. Uh... Benny Boy, Ma Mateo, Ultimate Fall Guys, uh, Wood Woodhead, uh, Woolhead, I should say, uh, Jack, Wilson, uh, John, everybody. So, alright, anywho, let's go ahead and start her up. Alright, so, the Princess Tour starts right now. So, let's go ahead and see what's going to be in the new section for this. Alright, so, what's the new in this tour? So, the new filter pop art has been added in for taking photos in auto mode. Okay, new auto mode feature. Uh, Peach Wedding and Gold Cupid's Arrow are uh, are in the spotlight for it. Next is Sweet Day Tripper and Wee Daisy Circuit as a favorite course. Above items are listed on sale. So that's for week one. The Peach Me Racing Suit is on sale in the shop as well. Of course, one that was on sale last tour. And then for our rank cup rewards, we have Red Birdo and the Red Turbo Birdo. And then the pink me suit in the second half with light blue toad pit crew. All right, you also get a gold pipe. Sounds good. Fire Rosina Cup is going to be the second half. All right, and sil gold and silver uh, wedding bells are going to be in the well, the gold pass glider for this for this tour. All right, and anything else we can see here? Yeah, these are just the first time items so you can exchange your rubies for. We have the Daisy me suit on here. And Cart Pro is back. Okay, so, gotta get those uh, win streaks going. We'll do our best to get that. Let's see, don't think Daisy Circle come to Booster Course Pass. Uh, yeah, I mean, at this point, we have a lot more uh, new retros coming into tour than there are slots left in the Booster Course Pass. Not unless they had a second one in. But Daisy Me Racing Suit, I think we'll get it since this has the Triple Banana Special skill, and I don't think we really intend on getting anything else, so... Let's just go for it. It'll power up our me suits. What the heck was that? Why did the audio just... Hmm. Okay, that was an in-game glitch. Did you guys hear that audio? That was... I don't think that was a stream issue. That was... 
an in-game issue. That didn't sound right. Because this in-game audio sounds right, the menu sounds right, but that character obtaining jingle did not sound right. Okay. <laughs> we'll, we'll clip that one. Game definitely did take drugs. I agree. Alright, so. Uh, let's move on to the next... Uh, okay, let's go and check out what we have in store for uh, Wii Daisy Circuit. That Mii suit is indeed haunted. So, in the top shelf, we have the gold Mii suit. Is this a natural buff, or is this... Whoa, whoa, okay, where are we going? This Mii suit has a lot of tracks. And this is a natural track buff for the gold Mii racing suit. So, by getting the Daisy Mii suit, we've just powered that up. Uh, Daisy is in top shelf on Daisy Circuit, surprisingly. And alongside Peach, who I think is getting a cup boost. So, yeah, free-to-play friendly track already. And also pay-to-win friendly. We have some super carts in the top shelf. Nice, nice. Do I have tickets to bring this up to max level? I could if I really wanted to. Eh, we'll save that for later. And then for glider, ah, we got ourselves another super glider. Nintendo's been a lot more generous with the, uh, the top shelves uh, lately. We've been seeing a lot more supers and even normals appearing in the, uh, the, uh, rank ups. Sort of holy water on the <laughs> daisy suit. Alright, so, let's make sure I get everything set up properly. Dun, dun, dun. Alright, start her up, switch it up to widescreen mode. Alright, let's see what we have in store for Daisy Circuit. We're gonna check out the normal variants of these tracks, and then we'll check out uh, what else is in... Uh, and I'll, then we'll check out the, uh, the T, R, and RT variants. Alright, so we Daisy Circuit looks really nice in Tour. I do like the... Uh, it already looks really nice in Mario Kart Wii. Just seeing it here in HD. Ooh, beautiful. Wait, were those seagull wings even flapping at all? I don't think they were. <laughs> you see that through that mobile game uh, uh, save wing? <laughs> Go for it. Get some comboing. Watch that. At least it's... Oh, we can take this out. Nope, we missed. Okay, we're obtaining tokens by hitting opponents. Oh yeah, since they're... Since this is Mario Kart Tour, we can hit the traffic cones to get some extra points. Oh, we can't... Okay, we couldn't get onto the platform that early. Could have sworn it was a bit different how you can get, get onto the sidewalk here. And at least the beginning of the tunnel and we. Alright, use the coin box, get some extra coins out of it. Alright, final lap. Definitely feels a bit harder to get onto the uh the, up the raised portion of the track. Hmm. Okay. Gotta figure out how we can approach that shortcut with the smart steering limitations. Blue shell coming and getting us. More cones hit. Thank you for those speed boosts, PD. Take that. Oh, get away from that super bell. Okay, coin box frenzy. Let's go. Let's see if we can catch up and maybe get first. Okay, they're going wide. We're going tight. Nice, we stole it first place in our first run of Wii Daisy Circuit for a good 29k for our first run on the track. Thank you, Coinbox Frenzy. But yeah, thoughts on that track? Hmm, it means alright. It feels like they didn't change much for Tour. It feels like one of those, like, gotta pat out the, uh, the content for the game, so just pour it over and has some nice upgrades here and there. And the statues look alright, but I don't think Daisy even has a mouth at all, so. Hmm. I don't know. But yeah, this one I say is probably less likely to get into the booster course fast, or at least the first one, if there's going to be if those rumors of a second one uh, come come to fruition. Remember the ultra shortcut video on this track? Oh yeah, the one where it jump scares you? <laughs> I remember that. Alright, so let's go ahead and move on to the next track on the, in the spotlight for this tour, which is going to be, what is it? GBA Peach Circuit. Alright, we're getting challenges. There's also a uh, cart pro as well. Gold challenges. Use a point cap ticket. Can't click coin rush one time. Alrighty. And we rise through the ranks. So chat, let me know your your initial thoughts on uh, Daisy Circuit. 
All right, so let's find regular Peach Circuit. There it is. It's going to be the first track of the next cup. All right, this is the second week rank cup. So, and the top shelf for Peach Circuit, we have... Okay, we have Peach in the top shelf. No, no surprise. Wow, Nintendo actually put on the title characters on these tracks. So we'll go with Peach. Quadruple cap, level 8. The gold standard is top shelf as well. But I think we're going to be going with the Super 1. And for our top shelf, we have... Okay, we have a Super Glider on here as well. Gold pass items. And I guess we'll have to go with our uh, Glittering Pyrosol. Alright, so, let's see what's in store for GBA Peach Circuit. It actually has fitting high-ends on this track. Even high-fitting supers on this track, surprisingly. Alright, Peach Circuit, let's see what you got here. I haven't heard the music for this track, so let's see how they remix it for tour. Dude, ooh, wow, this track looks really nice in tour. That background looks, sort of looks like Super Nintendo World. That's next normals, I know, right? Three, two, one, go! Ooh! Dun, 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 dun. Ooh, get super horned. Go! Uh, item ticket. Get it past you. Yeah, this, this remix re is really nice. I love it. This area looks kind of slanted like an anti-gravity section. Oh man, it feels like this track is shorter than it is in the original track. It felt very short. But I do like the uh, aesthetics they got going here. We got a lake right here. We can see the castle in the background. still has got a little bit of a Super Nintendo World aesthetic. Waterfall there is really nice to see. I suppose if there were a second booster course pass, I imagine this one would probably be an early track in that. But yeah, definitely I don't anticipate it for this first booster course pass that were uh, anything in the last two waves of this booster course pass, so still. Yeah, definitely, I definitely want to listen to the remix of the, the that tracks because it's it sounded awesome. So I imagine some people are going to prefer that over the Mario Kart 8 uh, version of the track because I think some people didn't like how slow it was, but hey. If you want a fast-paced remix of the um, Super Circuit circuit theme, then you got it right there in tour. Cool, cool. So, that's GBA Peach Circuit. I like it. Definitely, it's nice to see a uh, GBA track come in with uh, more changes to it than your than even the uh, the Wii track that barely got any differences. All right. So let's back out and start looking at the variants of these tracks. And we're getting a challenge. Or start so slow low, feel bored. Yeah, I mean, we'll see what else it, this tour has to offer. So we're just trying to see what else is here. Alright, so, Spotlight Shop. We got uh, Wedding Peach. We also have Peach Yukata in there. Some other stuff we don't have already. Got a new Mi Suit. We have the Daisy Balloon on there. Do we have any more high-end stuff? Okay, just two high-end glider tickets for now. We'll just keep collecting coins for now. Alright, so let me go ahead and just use some quick tickets in the last few cups, because we're going to probably have to search around for the other variants of these tracks. We have 26 of these quick tickets already, so not too big of a difference. Alright, so I think next up we're going to check out the R variants of these tracks. So we just did Peach Circuit, so we'll find uh, Wii Daisy Circuit R next. MLT, and we're just searching through these, see if we can find what we're looking for. That's Peach Circuit R right there. So it looks like Daisy Circuit R is right there. All right, let's see what we have in Top Shelf Four. We Daisy Circuit R. New Daisy Cruiser. I don't think that's in this tour, unfortunately. Okay, let's see. Hang on one second. Peach Circuit well Booster Course Pass Two. Nintendo. Yeah, they just reused the remix from uh, Mario Kart Eight. All right, so for We Daisy Circuit R, we have uh, Swimmer Daisy, Yukata Daisy. Farmer Daisy and uh, uh, Tie Dress Daisy. Uh, we also have a, nor a super uh, orange shy guy in the top shelf. You'd want him from that ranked up a while back. And so for top shelf, I guess we're going to be going with the uh, green tea, the lime tea coop. And. What is it? Uh, I'm forgetting the names of these. 
these gliders. That's the Wicked Topaz. Okay, so we'll go with this. My phone's starting to get really hot. Alright, now I'll switch her up. Yes, Rivali's Gale is now ready. Get bombed. Whoa! Okay. Audio glitched out for a moment there. Oh, I guess my casting might be uh, messing up. Okay, Topaz used to be meta. Oh yeah, it was a very useful glider. I mean, it still is. It still keeps popping up uh, in the rank ups. Okay, we can't go through the shortcut backwards. So maybe my casting thing is starting to get a little bit glitched out. That was okay, so it's definitely probably not an in-game problem. Da -da -da. Grab these coins. At least in the reverse variant, you can get onto that part of the uh, sidewalk a bit more easily. Alright, so... What if... Can we actually get through here? Okay, yeah, you can trick off the fountain there. That's really nice. I nice see glider on here. We can use to interact with more of the environment. Destroy an item. You can get up on top of the sidewalk quite easily on this one. Hmm, I have to see if that's possible in, like, the other variants of the track. But yeah, the glider ramp on uh, Daisy Circuit R definitely opens up some more possibilities, especially being able to uh, trick off the, uh, the fountain there, which is quite cool. Alright, so, switch her back. Now let's see what we have next in store. So we have Peach Circuit R, right on the line. Bones are going to chug a little bit. Get first place three times in a row. Give me that. It's for Valley's Gale. Uh, did you not hear it? It's a channel point redemption. More coins. Alright, so next up on the line we have the each circuit R. I saw it somewhere around. There it is. So we got Pauline Parting Time in this top shelf. And we also have the dog there. So I guess we're gonna see what the dog doing on the Peach Circuit R. And we're gonna go with the blooper shuttle, getting yet another track buff. And I guess we'll go with the uh, record set. So, let's see what we have in store for Peach Circuit R. Dun, dun. Yeah, the doggy's top shelf. So, nice to see Poochie get uh, some representation. Alright, I see a glider ramp here and a rock we could potentially trick off of. Hello, Blue Shell 19. Welcome in. How are you doing? Da -da 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 -da. Three, two, one, go! Mm, get to hear more of that uh, GBA uh, circuit remix. Ooh, Red Shell Frenzy, go, go, kill everybody! Take that, take that. What the dog doing? Nice, we can trick off the, the, uh, the rock there. Good start, good start. Keep up that mini turbo. Alright, still keeping the combo going into lap two. What's the dog doing? We'll let dogs out. Oh, we missed the glider. I'll just toss that item ticket. We got like almost well, a thousand of these. When I cut across the off road, my thing is gonna glitch out. Alright, super mini turbo. And get ourselves second place.
Just tuning in now soon. Guessing, uh, we're getting the new course now. Restorer, what? 15th place? Stop being the game <laughs> drugs. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, my phone does feel a bit hotter than usual. I don't know if something's going on with it. Might be about time for me to get a new phone or something, because it's been quite acting up lately when it comes to being captured. Because I'm having to do, like, a wireless casting to my computer. But anyway, moving on. Alright, another challenge obtained. Surprisingly, my restream chatbot is not here. What is going on here? Oh, maybe it's not here because I disconnected the account. Oh, that's right. Okay. Alright. Anyway, let's go ahead and redeem some pipe pools from our tour gifts. Alright, in our pipes we get, another maxed out normal glider, coins, more coins, and still more coins, let's go. We could use some more of these, because we use these to buy high-end tickets, even though I've, it's been a long time since I've actually participated in a ranked cup. So I just keep just setting the scores and just let everything happen. I don't like to take ranked cup as seriously as I used to be. I mean, I used to be like tier 99, and I'm all the way down to tier 91, just like, don't really, <laughs> get, I don't really care that much about it. Well, the speed circuit, it's a lot of depth. Yeah, every time they keep putting in a GBA track into tour, um, yeah, they go all out and just uh, add, like, depth and, just, like, put some turns to it, so it's, like, really nice to see uh, Nintendo putting some effort. Uh, it's weird to see Nintendo put so much effort into the GBA tracks, but not really as much into, like, the other retro tracks that come in. I don't know what's going on there. But yeah, anyway, next up on the, on the list, we are gonna go to uh, Daisy Circuit T. So, there's also RT variants we'll check out later. Uh, where's Daisy Circuit at T? I think I saw it at the end of it. There it is. So, for Daisy Circuit T, we have Gold Chuck and King Mario in the top shelf. A lot of me suits up there as well. Now, I have no top shelf cart for this, so we're gonna have to use some rubies soon. I mean, it's not even rank up, but hey, we like to keep our 100% track, track coverage. So, I guess we'll go with the middle shelf cart and the red and gold, uh, Umbrella is going to be top shelf as well. This, this glider is goaded. Alright. Next track. Daisy Circuit T. So we have ramps going around the fountains here. And, okay, we're going out into the ocean a little bit. Wouldn't it be cool if we could go underwater for a short bit? Alright. da 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 Three, two, one, go! Oh, we got rocky wrenches on this track. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, even though the audio glitches out every so often, it feels like I have no audio delay. Which is nice. Hmm, I suppose we'll take it. Take that. I do love the Daisy Circuit thing, it's really nice. Okay, so yeah, it's they made it easy to uh, hop onto the sidewalk and when you miss it. And we're getting a coin box frenzy! Okay, blue shell coming out. Alright, do we trick off that? We do not trick off that part of the sidewalk. Yeah, there's really no incentive to go up here, aside from dodging red shells. So I imagine the red shells could probably still break on that. Is the shortcut still available? It is. Okay, we go through there. There's a boost ramp right here. Oh, and an extra item box there. Okay, you do want to go for that shortcut. So there's an item box. I forgot it has an extra item set there. So pretty much all high all high score runs, you gotta take the shortcut. Even if you don't have an item, just go right through the, the cardboard cutout. You probably can pick up your coins if you drop for extra to keep the combo. Jump boost. Back it. Okay, so I think this... Tr the T variant of uh, Wii Daisy Circuit missed out on a big opportunity to have us go under the water, or at the very least, bounce off the boats. That would have been a really cool little concept to have for the trick variant of uh, 
Daisy Circuit. Maybe the RT variant will have it, but honestly, there's a missed opportunity here that uh, the, de the dev should have definitely taken advantage of. But yeah, it's alright. Missing out on a uh, really nice idea there. Alright, so in Street Fighter, they've loved GBA tracks. Broken Fear and Rainbow Road. Yeah, I imagine maybe, maybe we'll get those at some point. Alright, so we got five more Grand Stars and more uh, Tour Gifts. Nice, and a 12 points challenge, making progress. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, let's grab some more Tour Gifts. We got ourselves the Gold uh, Wedding Bells. Fire that pipe. Let me get more coins out of it. And Larry. Okay. He's getting close to max. And the gold bells. Alright, so next up we're going to check out Peach Circuit's T. Did I see that in a rank cup? Draft? Yes, the very first cup of the tour. So, this will be part of rank cup this week. Got a 5k rank cup last week? Haven't checked it. I see, I see. Yeah, I mean... I don't think I got too much above uh, 100k. I mean, I wasn't paying much. I haven't cared too much about rank up lately. Just because. I mean, you're already tier 99 already unlocked the the uh, 300 ruby reward. <laughs> There's really no incentive to keep going. Alright, so we're going to have the dog come back. See what the dog doing on Peach Circuit T. The pink speeder is getting top shelf buff. Along with the wonderful diamond. So the wonderful wings may not get a buff, but we get that wonderful diamond above. Switch her up. Feeling nostalgic hearing Daisy Circuit from Wii? Oh, absolutely. Alright, so, Peach Circuit T is up next. I'm gonna see what else we have in store for this track. I wonder if we'll be able to explore more of the environment uh, in the background. Three, two, one, go. Okay, we get some little speed bumps we can go off of for some extra tricks. Ooh, are we looping around? Okay, I thought we were doing a, a loop around the that mushroom there. Oh, there's a beach here. That's pretty cool. I don't think you really see that normally. Unless, uh, yeah. You, you'd really not be able to see this that beach otherwise. It would have been cool if we got onto the beach there. So yeah, that, yeah, so far the T variant of this track, you're kind of above the track most of the time, you just follow mostly the same path. And it is does provide a nice view of the beach, so I don't think we would have seen that otherwise. Drop that, drop that, drop the glider. Ooh, yeah, this gliding section right here does provide an opportunity to, like, nearly mess somebody up. What if, uh, actually, was the item set before the glider? So you can see a multi-box opportunity there. There is a potential multi-box opportunity there, I see. I should have tried doing it. I think if you swoop down at the beginning of that gliding section, you could respawn before the item set and keep farming additional items. Let me do that, actually. I want to ch try that out. That's got me curious. Normally, I don't do the same track twice in a row for these streams, but we gotta check this out. Guess you Peach, is, Peach I, I has Castle Villa by the seaside. Yeah, she has a lot of castles. Here we go. Lucky 7 Frenzy, but we're in first place, so it's not really as useful. Get you out. Alright, let's swoop her down. Yes, this is, this is a multi-box strat. Look at that. We just... Went back, got some more items, and we got a Mushroom Frenzy out of it. Cool. Three more item pools. So this track is going to be very easy to grind for rank up, especially for Poochie, because Lucky 7s love having uh, additional item pools like this. See, we already got a shot. Give me that, like, 14 tokens from that. Catching up. Alright, final lap. We still got an 8th place box. We can't pull 7s in this position. Nice, we're already in 1st place. But we can do the multi-box strat again. Maybe we'll do it just twice, so that way we don't lose too much time. Take that. Oh, do we still get an 8th place box? 
Oh, we didn't. We got a 7th place box. Toss that out. Lucky 7 Frenzy. Alright, let's try catching up. Do it, do it, do it. Kill everybody. Nice, into first place. Very good race right there. See, that's the power of the multi-box strat. Why well, you only want to do it twice on the second lap. Yeah, we got a multi-box track on this track. I love it when tracks have it. So, that instantly made the T-Variant a lot better. Because it's fun doing multi-box strats like that. Gives us a nice view of the beach. And, hey, we can actually pull off some item smuggling in uh, <laughs> some uh, rank up. Cool, cool, cool. I like it. I like it. Definitely better than the T-Variant of uh, Daisy Circuit. Smuggling tour. For shame. We got a good score out of it. Yeah, we got a 15k increase because, yeah, we did uh, some item smuggling. So, we're gonna highlight that. That could be used for, like, a Twitter clip or something. One thousand coins. Do do. Get some more pipe bulls. Dry bones. Coop, getting up to level 4. Warship. Alright, that's all the pop pipes from that one. Uh, what's here? Daisy Me Racing Suit. We'll check that out once we're done uh, looking at the RT variants. So we just did Peach Circuit T, so it's now time to look, move on to the RT variants of these tracks. So next up is Daisy Circuit RT, which is going to be in the second uh, rank cup for this tour. Squeak the hat. Alright, we squeaked the hat. There you go. Thank you, Penny Boy, for the uh, squeak. The circuits, uh, Bryce's Castle, and Rome Roads exist in dim other dimensions are all the same place. I don't know. It's not really... Yeah, you... This... It's weird. Mario Kart's timeline is so weird, because we have the babies racing alongside their adult counterparts, and then we have... I don't know. It's kind of some weird Doctor Who time vortex stuff. Make the hat harder. Ooh, I never heard him make that noise before. There you go. That's what she said. Alright, for Wii Daisy Circuit, we are going to be using the, uh, yellow Mi suit. We also have Taurus Toad in the top shelf as well, if you got him from the Athens tour. I don't see too much use out of him, so... And we also have the Gold Pipe Ring, which I believe was a Gold Pass gift from a previous tour. Uh, so we'll go for that for our top shelf. And... And we also have the Sunny Surf Master in top shelf as well. Level 7, triple cap, so, hey, we are going to use Dance. Alright, let's see what RT variant has in store for us. Will we go into the water this time? Or ramp off some boats? Not paying for your hat if you're broke. <laughs> Three. Okay. Three. Two. One. Let's go. Combo going. Okay, we're not even going out into the water at all. Get some ramps wide. Still no incentive to go on top of the sidewalk here. There are some cones here to interact with. Reactions. Get trailed. Ooh, are we looping around the, uh... Okay, I do like the uh, idea of me turning these, uh, fountains into, like, a figure eight, like, loop type of thing. Are we gonna do it again on the next fountain? Doesn't look like we are. That would be cool if there are two loops there. Ah, oh, we lost combo data. Oh, coin frenzy! Go, go, go! Okay, extra ramps. You can go off of here. And pick your favorite ramp. No coin on there. There's not that many coins on this track, I can tell. Are there any coins at all? Okay, there are some coins there. It's only on the ramps. So yeah, if you want to do your daily grind for coins, maybe this isn't the right track for you. Because there's barely any on the track. Give me them coins. They're cones and coins. I'm not first, so yeah, that's yours. You say that she, si she said. I mean, I didn't say that. I just said, hey, yo. Now 
And plus, I've been hanging out with the TM crew a little bit too much, because uh, so that's why I say hey yo quite a lot. Oh, no, we missed those ramps. Alright, so, yeah, RT variant of this track, it's pretty cool we make a, a loop out of one of the uh, parts of the uh, fountain section. That's that's a really nice concept to have. Still missing out on the opportunity to ramp off boats or go underwater here. So, honestly, that's something I would have added in if I designed the uh, uh, the T or RT variant of uh, Daisy Circuit, because that would have been so cool to do that. Because when you have these extra variants of these tracks, you just you just get a lot get very creative. Alas, they missed that opportunity, but hey, they at least have something creative on this variant of the track. Alright, so let's back out and then check out Peach Circuit RT. But first, we got some more gifts to unlock. And 15 hits of bananas. Got it, bingo! Bingo bongo. Alright, just some rubies and coins. Alright, so finally we have Peach Circuit RT. Where is that? I don't think there's any other new RT variants that I'm aware of. Sometimes I like to Nintendo like to slip in a new RT variant of a track we haven't had already. And I think we've gotten all these uh, RTs in here in a previous tour. Peach Circuit RT, there it is. I see a potential bold bill extension area with how long that mushroom section is in the thumbnail. See you later. Alright, thank you for stopping in, Gilligan. Appreciate it. Ooh, whoops, ow, that hurt my ears. Alright, so for top shelf, we got the PD Me racing suit. Along with the Camo Tanuki cart. And the Waluigi mustache. Alright, Peach Circuit RT, what do you got for us? I see a Bull Bill extension area, so I might like this track for a different reason. Alright, so we got some pipes on the road we can ramp off of. There's... where's the mushrooms? How long is that mushroom section? Looks like it's close to the end of the track, so... I definitely see this potentially being more of a bagger track. Yeah, three mushrooms right there, so that's definitely Bullet Bill extension area worthy. Alright, let's go. Points. Yeah, I had to go tight so we didn't lose the combo. Ooh, it's been a nice time to have a boomerang. What's that? Alright, can I pull another coin box so I can boom box off of that? Take that. Oops, I hit the cannon by mistake. Didn't want to do that. So yeah, we do have a slight Bullet Bill extension area toward the end of the track here, so if you get Bullet Bill, it'll be very useful toward the end of this race. And bagging in tour is a bit difficult since you don't have much time to do it. Back it. Nice. Oh, no, I don't take your time. When you have almost a thousand tickets, you can just be a little bit more, uh, you know, free with all your tickets. I like how close to the castle we get. It would be nice to actually go like within like the castle walls or anything like that, but hey, that's an alright one. I think I do prefer the T variant because, you know, it's quite fun uh, playing around with multi-box strats to get like extra points and just combine bagging with the high score mode. It's, it's really fun doing that in tour. Alright, so I suppose favorite variants of each one, I'd say... Uh, T variant for Peach Circuit, and then for Daisy Circuit? Hmm. I don't know, the, all the variants Daisy Circuit are kind of eh, in a way. I don't know which one I prefer out of those. They could have done better with the variants of uh, Wii Daisy Circuit, honestly. But yeah, those are all the new tracks being added to tour. I don't believe there's any new RTs from what I can tell. Uh, let's see. Getting some more of these. Yeah, no new RT variants, unless someone in chat has any information on that, but I don't think, yeah, there's anything else new. But, wait, hang on, there's one more new thing we can check out. The Daisy Me Racing suit we got. Let's go and go do our daily challenge. Alright, see you later, Finny. Thank you for stopping in. 
And remind if you guys haven't already done so, make sure to hit the like button on the stream. Definitely uh, helps out in the YouTube algorithm. So, appreciate all of you stopping here for the uh, first date, first night of the Princess Tour. Here we go. Oh, glitching out again. Hmm. Oh, what's going on with the casting lately? I mean, it's weird how we got, like, better quality over time, and then now suddenly it, the audio disappears, and... Hmm. And now the... Yeah, there is no audio delay for me right now. It's glitching out, but surprisingly no audio delay on my end. I like it. I'll take it. This, the situation just seems to just fix itself sometimes. Oh, lag... That. After this. Yes. Yeah, it is a bit odd that the Daisy Me suit uses the triple banana special and not the, the heart special. Weird thing. It's normally the Me suit takes the same special item as the driver. But hey, at least it makes this one a little bit more valuable. This triple banana is a pretty decent special skill. Usually when I see a Me suit with a special skill that's like plus or something like that, then we'll take it. Coinage. Dun 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 dun. Blocking. Drop bananas. Block the road. Nice, got him. Up, oh, losing combo. So I wonder what what special. Wait, hmm, I'll look at that once I'm done the race. It's, it's quite a lot to read. Let me finish up this race and then we'll read that that comment. And get ourselves a nice first place with the Daisy Me Racing Suit. So, we have an alternate Princess Mancalor on. See, this is the best princess in the tour. It's me. I am the best princess in Mario Kart, Mario Kart Tour. But yeah. Hey, Vanessa, welcome in. So, uh, I've always wondered if there's specific items, drivers that are better for each track, like besides the driver that appears in the pictures. There's a, is it the only way of testing one by one? Um... Yeah, there are certain special items that are more favored than others uh, by a specific track. Like, if there's a T variant of a track that has a lot of ramps, that makes it harder for you to grab the coins from a coin box because they keep getting launched up and off the track. So at that point, you may want to use, like, a Lucky 7 driver or a Boomerang. Or if it's a track like uh, Peach Circuit T earlier, even though that's coin box friendly, um, you can't get coin box frenzies when you're in the very back. So, uh, and since that has a multi-box strat, that phaser is more the lucky seven, because those become very common when you're in like seventh place or sixth place, so that's just one example of a certain special item being more favorable than another. Alright, so I think we've just checked out all the new track variants, and we checked out the new Daisy Mead Racing suit to get 500 extra coins out of our uh, daily challenge. Thank you, Jason, for the 25 bits. Pretty little princess. Have fun, internet. Yes, I am a pretty little princess. Alright, giving them tickets. We also get ourselves some nice silver and gold balloons. We already have these. So that becomes level 2. Alright. I don't think there's anything else we really want to do. Uh, we got some pipe fires we can, we can do right now, so we got the tokens for it. Right. Token pipe fire time. Launch! Let's see what else we get out of here. Oh, five driver boost tickets. We already got 200 of those. Hmm, eh, sometime I should probably just try a bin rank up regardless of what reward I get. Point cap ticket. Alright, one more pipe fire. Let's go. Alrighty, so... What do I feel like doing right now? We've already finished all the, the uh, checked out all the new tracks. Is there any pipes we can get from this? No, no pipe from here. Honestly, I'm getting quite tired at the moment since, uh, I don't know, I guess I maybe I'm still tired from doing all the mo mocking at Momocon, so I think we'll probably end off this stream here since, uh, yeah, we don't want to be up too much longer. I feel the drowsiness starting to hit me, but uh, maybe when I get more rest, maybe later today I might do another Mario Kart Tour stream and we'll check out Kart Pro and uh, other content being added into the tour. So I do appreciate everybody stopping in for today's stream where we check out all the new variants of... Um, 
Daisy Circuit and uh, Peach Circuit. So, let's go ahead and get a raid going. If you guys haven't already, make sure to hit the like button on the stream, and please join us for the raid, whether we rate it on Twitch or YouTube. Please go on, come on over from whatever uh, site you're watching on. Alright, let's see if we can find anyone to raid. Because, yeah, I don't like feel that drowsiness in me, so we don't want to stay up too much longer. Actually, let me see if there's any other tour streamers on YouTube who are still going. We've not rated a YouTube streamer in a while. I think I might know who to rate if they are still alive at the moment. Yes, Frenzy Fans is still alive. Alright, let's go ahead and give Frenzy Fans a raid. They're streaming the uh, the Princess Tour, so let's go ahead and give them a nice raid. They're the people who made the uh, the Frenzy Fans calculator, which is really useful for calculating what score uh, you can get in a uh, rank up for any given week. So definitely, definitely go check out their channel. So, appreciate everybody stopping in for today. Uh, let me try to get the chat things posted. Yeah, the link posted to both chats. Alright, so... There's a link for the YouTube chat. There's a link for Twitch chat. Good night, Princess Minkalore. Yeah, you asked for it. Okay, yeah, I'll go tonight. I'll be a sleeping beauty. Alright, so there's a link for Twitch chat. Go ahead and hop in with the, with the Minkalore raid. Appreciate everybody stopping in for today. Make sure to like if you haven't already done so. Let's go ahead and uh, check out uh, Frenzy Fans of the Raid. Take care, everybody, and bye bye